Hey veterans, I'm the veterans lawyer. I handle VA disability appeals for veterans and their families. I wanted to take a minute and tell you about an important report that came out today that I read from the VA Inspector General. He looked at um, a sampling of VA disability cases where VA ordered uh, medical exams, also known as C&P examinations, and got medical opinions in veterans' disability cases. And in those, he found a shocking percentage of errors overall. I'll get to what that percentage is in just a minute, but a few of the types of errors that he found was VA personnel not giving uh, these medical examiners relevant and important evidence or facts related to the veteran's case. Also, when they send out for these exams, they send instructions on what they're looking for, the types of questions that they need answered. Oftentimes, the inspector general found that uh, the, the instructions were, were not clear or not concise or accurate. And I see that all the time in, in exam requests that I see sent out by VA as well. In other cases, VA did not request medical examinations or medical opinions when they should have. That means these veterans were not helped by VA to develop evidence necessary to win their claims. And that's one of VA's duties under the law. Finally, in other cases, uh, they ordered exams that were not even necessary. VA could have decided the issues and perhaps granted the claims, but they sent these out for exams. So what does that mean? Why is that relevant? Well, of course, VA uh, has limited resources, although they had $6.8 billion over five years for medical exams. But this means that they used some of that money for exams that weren't necessary. They wasted their resources and spent taxpayer dollars unnecessarily. Okay, so at this point, you're probably thinking, was I affected by all of this and my VA disability claim? Well, the, the odds are that you probably were. And again, I still haven't given you that percentage. What I want you to do is comment below and give me your best guess as to what percentage of VA disability cases had errors related to medical examinations. I'll give you the answer in the next video, and I'll also tell you why all of this is relevant in your VA disability case and what you can do about it.